Hi everyone, this is Dr. Paul at No BS Water and I wanted to share something with you I found on the internet the other day. I was over there doing a diabetic symptoms quiz and uh, you know people go onto the internet all the, all the time to find out the symptoms of diabetes, the signs of diabetes and even the causes of diabetes. But you know what, I did that years ago because I am a diabetic and for many years I struggled. I took metformin, a common oral uh, control medication, uh, that sort of thing. I changed my diet, I lost a lot of weight, believe it or not, and, uh, and still struggled, struggled until about two and a half, three years ago. And I figured out something that had to do with water. Believe it or not, we all know that there are benefits of drinking water. But a lot of us don't know the signs of, uh, well, let's, should we put it this way, uh, diabetes and hydration. It matters more than you think, and certain types of water matter more than others. And so I want to share with you what I learned in, in my studies. There was, a, there was a research study done in Nordenau, Germany, on water that comes out of an old slate mine that had gone out of business. And originally there was a, a, an original self-report study where over a thousand people said they got better from all kinds of things. And they got so much better that nobody could deny it. And so some researchers set up another study just to try to help them understand because they couldn't figure out why all these people were getting better from changing their drinking water. You know, they were getting a lot of benefits from this drinking water. And so uh, the guy who set up the study originally with his group, Professor Gallmeyer, actually said something that I think is profound. I want to read it to you so I make sure I don't get it wrong. He said, quote, He who doesn't believe in miracles is not a realist. He who doesn't notice that something exists and could be seen by everyone or simply doesn't want to see a phenomenon because this phenomenon is not explainable at the moment, he departs from the rule of science. The medical scientists are allowed to wonder, to raise the questions, to write down their assured scientific observations, to create the hypothesis in order to test them at last within the scope of the established scientific methods. We as medical scientists are under an obligation to perceive and analyze each phenomenon of our daily clinical practice. Do you see what I'm saying? Many doctors don't agree with something as simple as changing your water. It can actually affect your blood glucose and your hemoglobin A1C, yet that's exactly what they found in this study. Interestingly, they also found that it affected LDL, HDL, serum creatinine. Now, these are markers that have to do with blood, uh, with uh, heart disease and stroke and uh, the other cardiovascular diseases. So this is a really big deal. I teamed up with my friend Colleen to form No BS Water. Colleen's actually an expert. She's a groundwater consultant and a water treatment specialist, and she designs uh, and, and uh, helps build uh, treatment systems, water treatment systems for both businesses and homes. She's been doing it for almost two decades. So we've put our, our heads together and we want to make sure that you understand what there is to know about water that will affect you, whether it's your water coming into your home, whether you should drink bottled water or not, and the verdict is not, and, uh, and uh, how it can affect your health, your body, and, and those that you love. So come on over and join us at NoBSWater.com. We'd love to have you get access to our free water education system. Just come on over and see us, NoBSWater.com. Have a great day.